Hello, hello, the stream is starting. How is everyone doing today? Hopefully well. Oh my gosh. I am very happy to be back here with Lilith, our Dark Ridge character. Very happy. Oh, she is so much fun to play, and I have been missing her very dearly. In between streams! I did a bunch of housekeeping, just to move shit around on various characters. Some of it worked well, some of it didn't. Oh, this is... my bar is an entire mess now. Did I... what did I do? Besides make a mess. <laughs> Strange. Oh yeah, this entire thing is a mess. Okay, I did housekeeping, but I didn't do that. Well, there is one thing that I will note. Is now, if you look at chat, our chat looks a bit different than before. There's a reason for that. Well, also my overlay is a little bit different because I added the text-to-speech stuff, since... You can use text-to-speech for just tiering five bits, which is... Four cents? I think? Yes, and then your money can yell at me. So, that is always quite fun. Okay, so... I spent a bunch of time today. Not as much as, I, as you would think. Hi, Ron! Oh, good. It's nice to see other people's chats are going through right as well. So, I made some changes to the chat today with a wonderful program. So, I've been watching a, uh, I'm watching a, a big Twitch streamer. A lot of you know him. His name is Doug Doug. He does coding and stuff on stream, among other things. And he started using a program recently that, uh, as soon as I saw it, I'm like, there's got to be something I can use this for. Uh, it's a program called Cursor. Basically, it uh, it's like any other program for coding. If you've uh, used like Visual Studios or Dreamweaver or Notepad Plus Plus or any of the other other places where you can edit code, uh, Cursor does that same stuff, except for it has a built-in AI companion, and that companion is surprisingly efficient at coding. Like I I've I've seen tr like I've I've watched people and I've tried talking to AI uh, who are not specialized in coding, and oh boy, do they suck at it. Like, they vaguely have an idea, but that's the best that they have. Cursor, however, has a number of AIs that it works with that are very good at coding, to the point that it general, generally, if you ask it to do something and you're clear enough, it will do exactly what you tell it to do, which is amazing. Why is that amazing? Well, I am really, really rusty with HTML and CSS. And oh my gosh, this is actually going to sound like an ad, but I just honestly, I've been like super excited. I, I haven't gotten any money from Cursor. Oh, God, I wish I had. That would be amazing. I would gush about them forever. Uh, but uh, <laughs> for anyone who is interested in coding or has done coding, uh, basically you can tell the AI to do things for you or to look at your code and to fix things in it that are like inefficient or reformat it to be more readable. And it can do all that stuff for you. It's incredibly efficient at it. And I haven't done web coding in like... I started, okay, some background. I started coding in high school. Uh, so that was about 15 years ago, give or take. Um, and I started with HTML and CSS. And eventually I got into a little bit of JavaScript, but like, it's been on and off for most of my life. And I am rusty. I'm really rusty at it. <laughs> I'm not, not, I'm not really... I'm not up on it. It's something that frustrates me because I do put time in like once every couple years to like refresh myself. 
but oftentimes it's just not enough to keep up with all the changes in coding because obviously it's a sector where if you can make something more efficient, you want to make something more efficient. So they keep updating everything. Anyways, cursor, since I understand the basics of programming and like how order of operations works, for loops, if statements, uh, just generally file structure, file systems, if, like with the basic knowledge of programming, you can use cursor to do all the fine stuff that you might not know how to do. So I was having some issues where the text in chat was indented to the fur to the name of the person who was talking, not to where the badges are, as you can see on uh, on chat right now. It was off by I don't know a little bit, and that's not a huge deal, but it does make it it does give a lot less space for you to show off the chat. So, this way, there's a lot more chat on screen. Anyways, it would have taken me, I'm going to say about four hours, with my current knowledge, to figure out that and the other things that I wanted to do to change the chat. And instead, I, in less than an hour, well less than an hour, I had Cursor do all the changes that I needed it to, that I needed from it. And I, I didn't have to put in energy that I just frankly don't have to put in. But I still wanted to. I even took the time to change out the uh, font that we're using to Open Sans. Well, Open Sans, technically. Because um, uh, Open Sans is the uh, font that I use for all of my graphics in all my thumbnails, all my everything. Because uh, it's one of Google's fonts, and it tends to be incredibly readable. It's kind of like what Comic Sans was supposed to be, because for those who don't know, Comic Sans is kind of a joke uh, in on the internet. It's like, oh, if you make something in Comic Sans, it's, be it's because you're not good at what you do and it looks stupid. Well, the original purpose of Comic Sans was to make something a font that was really easily readable for anyone, regardless of disabilities or anything like that, make it really readable to glance. And Open Sans has a very similar style to it, but it looks more professional. I mean, you can see what Open, open Sans is. Every piece of text on the screen right now is Open Sans. Just in a different size or width or weight or whatever. Anyways, it is an awesome program and I had so much fucking fun playing with it. I just, I, I wish I had more projects to work on because it is fucking awesome at it. I had it uh, go after some of my um, text documents that I wanted to reorganize. Because, like, not even just code. Like, I've gotten it to reorganize and, like, reorder for readability some of the, uh, some of, like, the lists that I have for uh, Baldur's Gate 3 challenges that I want to work on. And it's like, oh, well, you can expand this and you can put these indentations and in, you can put it in this style. And, like, oh, wow, that's really amazingly readable. It's like, wow, this is, uh, this saves me a lot of time. <laughs> and I am a little bit concerned that I will become overly reliant on it because it is so damn powerful that I don't know, like, there's a lot of knowledge I don't need now, and it would be very easy for me to lose it. But also, I'm already pretty rusty in a lot of these things, so I'm not going to lose very much anyways. <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to rant about that because, oh my gosh, I've been fucking in love with Cursor. It's been so much fun playing with it. I haven't enjoyed coding like this in a while, so it's been really great. And I'm hoping to make other changes to make our stream look even cooler because the text-to-speech system is not exactly the way I want it to look. And I have a plan to use custom HTML and CSS and J JavaScript I keep, I keep wanting to say jQuery, because I'm used to jQuery, um, to uh, just make it look nicer. And I'm, I'm, I, I plan to do a lot of things, because a lot of things involving streaming are actually coding-based, or they can be if you want them to be, and uh, this is a great chance for me to do that. It just I'm basically just making myself excuses to use Cursor. <laughs> Anyways... Okay, so let's get back into actual Baldur's Gate. 
So, uh, we are currently in the Underdark, for those who remember what's happening. I'm just going to teleport to the Mike Indy Colony. So, this is the Underdark. We started in the Selenite Outpost, that is underneath the uh, where the goblins were in uh, Act 1. And we've walked around and we've done a bunch of stuff. We found the Mykonid Colony, which is the group of mushrooms. Uh, we stopped and we picked up some items in one place or another. Uh, we went and killed the slavers down here. We went and found the uh, mushroom man, I think. No, we didn't find him yet. He's up there. Uh, and we found the Susu Bark, which allowed us to make a cool dagger. And that was fun. So, we have some stuff to do today. I've been doing Baldur's Gate 3 challenges a whole lot lately, and they have been really fun. We did the, uh, we did the Baldur's Gate 3 uh, kill a red level 10 red dragon in the first act challenge. That was really fun. Uh, the way that it ended was unfortunate, but that's such as life. Uh, I will be putting that up on YouTube when I get the chance to edit it, because, I mean, well, I mean, I want to do many challenges where I can. We also finished the Commander Zulk uh, challenge run, where we are trying to kill the level 8 Commander Zulk in the tutorial area with only two level 1 characters, Shadowheart and Lizelle. That is done now. I managed to succeed in under five minutes, which is ridiculous, having done it. I could probably get it down to four and a half minutes if I tried, but I'm not going to because I'm satisfied with what I've done, and that will be coming out as a video on at Black Cat Studio soon. Okay. That's all the... It's all the housekeeping, I think. No, it's not. Uh, next week, I'm going to be moving the stream time by an hour and a half earlier. So, starting next Tuesday, seven days from now, we are going to be streaming at 1 p.m. PST, 5 p.m. No, sorry, 4 p.m. EST. That is 1 p.m. PST, 4 p.m. EST. This is so that I'm better set up to the times when Baldur's Gate is popular on Twitch, just because I want to keep expanding my channel. And we're going to keep moving with that. I've, I've talked for a couple of months about the fact that I'm going to be changing my times, and it's, well, it's time next week. Uh, this Thursday, I still will be doing it the same time, which is 2.30pm uh, PST, 5.30pm EST, but that will be the last stream at the later time. I'm sorry to anyone who won't be able to see the streams when they start anymore. I genuinely am saddened by that, but I need to keep growing the channel, and this is the best I can do. Uh, if anyone, uh, if you find that you can't get here in time, that's totally okay. If you want to stop in later, hey, I'll be happy to have you. And if you stop in, you're like, hey, I don't know what's going on. Just ask. I will gladly recap what we've done in the stream. Totally. So... That is worth noting. Okay. So, we have... We have... What's the name? Sovereign Glut here, who we avenged his people, but we're going to try to get around showing him that his people are avenged so that we can bring him across the river to where the quest is that the Myconid Sovereign has sent us on. Because Spa, the Mykonid Sovereign up here, has sent us to... That was weird. Has sent us to go and kill Nier. Nier is one of the true souls, and like one of the big uh, proponents of uh, the Cult of the Absolute. And also our gateway to Act 2. So, we are going to head off and do that soon. Why is my character walking separate of the other ones? That was weird. Okay. So let's go find Glut. Wait. No, we're not going to find Glut. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to the beach. And we are going to go until we find a new... Waypoints. 
Oh my god, the Sylvanas' blessing thing is so annoying. I'm gonna send that back to camp for now, just because it's starting to really get on my nerves. It's cool, but it, it all it gives is plus one to nature and animal handling, and I don't need that in the Underdark, really. Okay, Shadowheart, can you... Oh, you don't even have a level three spell slot to use right now. How are all my spell slots and everything? Mm, we're kind of out. Oh, we are kind of outish. Oh, okay. We need to take a uh, long rest. Right. I forgot about that. Okay. We're going to do a long rest and then we will go out and do things. Let's try that again. We are going to take a long rest and then we will go out and do things. What are you hiding? Can you summon the dead? Bring them back? Can you... Um, can you shut up and let me read? Need some help? What? No, I'm, I'm fine. I was just perusing this little find. Will you shut up? <sighs> Forgive me. This book reads you more than you read it. It really does. What do you mean? I mean it plays with your mind. There are secrets here, but the book has spirits. They fight you every step of the way. I almost reached the end before they drove me out and drove me all but mad. Now, every time I open it, the voices surge back into my mind. I can't reason with them. They exist to protect that book. Hmm. It makes you wonder if I could cast Calm Emotions from Shadowheart on him, and if that would work. Is there anything we can do? Maybe. Maybe not. It's hard to know what's lurking in here. Someone went through a lot of trouble to protect this tome. It has to be something more than a book of cantrips. Still, I doubt this will help us with our parasites. Maybe it's better to put it aside for now. Mm. What are you hoping to find there, anyways? It's a book of necromancy, full of secrets about controlling the dead, returning the dead to life, and who knows what else. Sexy. If it isn't here, it might give me an edge over Casador. Or free me from him entirely. Although I can't make any progress, as long as those spirits remember their mission, it seems to be all they know. Still, if nothing else, maybe I can beat Cazador to death with it. It is a pretty heavy book. Looking at something. Oh, okay. The book's gone. What do you mean, how, do I, how did you know I was here? He can see you in the mirror. Just looking. What are you doing? I'm looking too. But not seeing very much. Another quirk of my affliction. Uh, small price to pay for a vampire's power. I think she would be more power hungry. To you, maybe. To me, it's just another thing Cazador took. I've never even seen this face. Not since it grew fangs and my eyes turned red. Hmm. It's for the best, you know, it's actually aging gracefully. <laughs> no. What color were they before? I... I don't know. I can't remember. Aww. Just some dark shape in my past. Another thing I've lost. Okay, the first one is definitely Romance Path. Uh, why? Why does it keep giving me the option to just like fucking insult him? Uh, you maybe. I like what I see. And what do you see exactly? Hmm. Strong, piercing eyes. Oh, go on. That dangerous smile. Very good. 
Now just tell me I'm beautiful and we can call it a day. Can I call him a whore? <laughs> uh is that all you want? Shallow praise? Hardly. There's also goal, sex, revenge. He likes that. But for awesome. Any of those, I will always settle for shallow praise. Ah, <laughs> uh, fun. Okay, sleep, sleep time. I've come to sate you and be sated. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh yes, just needed to turn 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 that off. Uh uh, <laughs> uh uh yeah, sure we'll fuck. So you think. Let's see if you're right. Gith train relentlessly. We know our bodies inside and out. Hey. This is Act 1, again. We're not in Act 1. <laughs> yeah, lizard time. Do you wanna fuck a lizard? I'm worried what it will show me. Don't get me banned on Twitch! Okay. Okay, no, no, no. Sorry. Um... Gonna have to skip this. One second. I don't, I don't trust Twitch. I'm sorry. A poor taste. And you will take sorry. Don't trust Twitch. Don't trust YouTube. If you want to watch the sex scenes, I would highly suggest... <laughs> Stupid sexy lizard. Yeah. God, the fucking, that fucking Simpsons joke has continued to be amazing for... Like a decade. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, uh, for the way that YouTube and Twitch works, I don't, I don't know what Twitch actually, like, necessarily, what their guidelines are. I know that they don't always follow their own guidelines, but I know with YouTube that they will change their guidelines retroactively and then punish you for retro their retroactive changes for your previous content. So I don't want what I'm doing to, like, I think what I'm doing is within the bounds of YouTube, but if YouTube decides to change their guidelines, they could just still punish me anyways. So, I uh, not worth it. I still have Leviatar's love from being a what was the word a uh, uh, uh sick blood pervert. I forget what the word was that the words that they used. I know there was blood pervert in it. That's cool though. Or maybe it stays till I get to thirty percent hit points or less. Anyways, okay. What am I doing, Shadow Heart? Do we need to do anything? Uh, produce flame. Keep that up. Izel, do you have anything to summon? Yes, you do. I will summon Quoth. Uh, do I want to pick anything for today? Skill proficiencies. What do I want for today? Kana, history, insight, medicine, perception, survival. Intimidation, performance. I'll take charisma. That gives me advantage on those checks today. Cool, cool. Starring, do you have anything to cast at the start of the day? No, you don't. <laughs> Scratch keeps walking past the traveler's chest, which has the, the Susu blossoms in it that create the anti magic field. <laughs> so it keeps getting the anti magic debuff. Okay, and I will summon Scratch. And now that all that's done, I will spend a level 3 spell slot and give us aid for an extra 10 hit points. And that'll also buff our summons. 
I should have done this in a moment. Fuck. That was the wrong order, because I forgot that I wanted to summon a... Uh, whoops. Target can't be reanimated. Why not? Sure, I'll take you. Okay. Let's go. I'm on a boat, man. Going fast, man. I don't remember the words to this song. <laughs> Sail into the darkness. Wow. Wend? Wend? You there! Drow! Why are you in Gexroft? We aren't expecting more of you. Where's Gek? Who are you? So, we know from experience that that true soul near is across the lake, wherever they are. So, they obviously know about him, well, since, they, they, since they said, oh, we're not, it wasn't expecting any more of you. Okay. Uh, what should I say? Name of the Absolute, you will let me pass. Deception, I'm afraid Gek is dead. He fell fighting the Magnids. It's fun pushing him to the water, but I'm not going to. Oh my god! That's a plus 11! <laughs> plus 11 to Deception! I don't even have Shadow Hearts or Guidance on me. <laughs> it's a DC 10! I can't fail! <laughs> Screwed up. Nero lose his head over this. Move over. I'll take you to shore. You're the one telling the sergeant what happened. Sure. The rest of you, keep patrolling. I'm heading back with the drow. You continue forward in silence until the lights of a camp twinkle through the murk. So many good screenshots for a thumbnail. The Lady of Pain, Misery, and Loss. These are all Sharian statues. Well, I'll be plowed sideways. We've got a welcoming party. <laughs> I don't want to imagine you getting plowed sideways, I'll be honest. A hairy old small dude. You shithead! Time you showed up! We got trouble! Spit it out! Sergeant finally choked on true soul near's prick! <laughs> <laughs> The twat soul caused a rock fall. Trapped tighter than a ring on a fat finger. You're shitting me. You pay up? That's the trouble. He's got the gold on him. Sergeant's arm is falling off with all the gnome slaves she's been beating. Who's the hoon? Friend of Nears? Or you plow and drow now? Ew. I love- one of my favorite things about the Dwegar, which is what this race is, 
is the fact that every time they talk about the true souls, they always call them the twat souls. <laughs> I just like the way that they talk. It's so like brash and like and sailor esque. It's great. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh, actually, wait, no, she wouldn't say that because she's incredibly charismatic. I'm a true soul, and you will retreat me with respect. That's so. I. You feel the slightest of stirrings in your head. The Dwergar is not infected, yet your minds resonate. I'll be. You ain't shitting. Felt the tingle. Your twat soul chum owes us a load of coin. You want through? Make a donation. Okay, let's see. What should I go for? Um, I'll take your head before you take my gold. Don't clog your hole. Just shitting around. But I'm warning you. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. Yeah, 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 whatever. Oh. Yay! We're here! Charlatan, a friend to all. What? Right, gain access to Grim Forge peacefully by lying to the Raft Patrol. Oh, cool. Battered note. What does this say? Hey, prickheads. Hey, prickheads. Slave Grub in the right barrel. Rothchow in the left. Next time any of you shit says he flub at... Flub... Ah, God damn it. Next... Next to you shits, I see flubbing it is going getting a pop poker up the R sideways. Thrin. <laughs> uh, anyways. Onwards. To Waypoint. Okay, and now Mike Nid Colony. Hopefully this does not go badly. Uh, nope. Okay. Already got... Already got a save point. Where am I? Okay. I'm here. Huh. Let's go through the haste spores to speed up. Okay. Glut. Invite Glut to your party. Cool. He's part of my party now. Go to Grimforge. Oh. But it's not in the un or it's not out of the Underdark. I I'm in the Underdark still. Grimforge is in the Underdark. That's the whole point. Whatever. Fucking, fucking doof of a mushroom. Okay, well, mushroom fucker has, uh, has not been useful. Whatever. Whoever built it, come into her shadow. Let all that is past be forgotten. Okay. Stonesmith, stone mason kith. How peculiar! Smooth face, cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. What luck! Look here, Hoon. I seek fresh eyes. Care to lend yours to a weary mason? A suspiciously eager welcome from a Dwegar. Ease your suspicions. I've got no mind for slavery. My passion is stone, and my god is the chisel. But these learned eyes reach their limits, and so I must 
humbly request yours. Oh, hi, Sophia Blade. Welcome to the chat. Things are going great. We're just finishing up some cool stuff in Act 1 of Baldur's Gate 3 on our Dark Urge character. How are you today? Fine, what should I be looking at? The rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. Okay, what do I have bonuses to? Perception. Survey the area for unforeseen curiosities. Guidance. 24. Several glassy stones stand out in the debris. Their borders are coated with tiny yellow crystals. The hottest of flames smoothed the stone and left sulfuric crystals behind. The fires of the hells have touched Grimforge. Oh, I made my PNG. I'm a graphic designer, so my, uh... My chat, my overlay, my PNG, all of my thumbnails, all of my graphics, everything is done by myself. It's one of my fave things to do. I wish I could have Lizelle do this. I do. I wish I could say I make 3D stuff. Like, I would love a 3D model, but I don't have the money to pay for it, and I don't have the time to learn the skills to do it. I'm, I'm specialized towards the type of graphic design that is more product design or marketing and business and stuff, so actually designing and interfaces, actually designing characters and stuff is not my forte. But, uh, I'm quite happy with how she's turned out. History! meandering curves and golden edges stand out against the weathered masonry behind it. Two styles, two eras. The statue was carved from newer stone and erected by latecomers to this ancient fortress. Anything standing out? Investigation, because why not? Oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm going to lose the knowledge I already gained. <laughs> Boulders and stone bricks of various sizes clutter the corridor. Many split cleanly in two. Yet some walls remain fully intact. What this pattern signifies, you can't fathom. I really wish in this game they actually had some sort of, like... Critical successes and fails don't do anything in most dialogue scenarios. They do stuff in combat, but, like, most dialogues, whether you would get a 19 or a 20, doesn't matter so long as you succeed the role. The statue is newer than the fortress, you say? So obvious in hindsight. Sulfur? Of course! The rocks have been altered by hellfire! Alas, you've left me with more questions than answers. My survey continues. Okay. Well, I will say, from my own knowledge and research, that this is a stronghold of the Sharians, so devotees to Lady Shar like Shadowheart. Well, let's see what you've got. Yay, we have another merchant. He has nothing. He has, like, fuck all. Oh, that's unfortunate. He does have a post elixir bloodlust, though. I'm gonna buy that. Uh, arcane cultivation, sure. Uh, that's it, though. Yeah, I don't need anything else. Okay, that's unfortunate. I'd hope that he would have a little bit more than that. That's all then. At least we have someone who that we who we can sell shit to. Let's 
skeleton. Damaged Dark Just Seer armor. What Shadowheart wants to become? As you look at the skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. Dark Justicia uniforms. These were Shah worshippers. The same as me. Unfortunately, their armor is dramatically worse than what Shadowheart is wearing, because she is wearing, I don't know, sp scale mail? Splint mail? She, I think she's, she's wearing whatever comes before half plate, I think. Um, no, no. Whoever killed them made an enemy of a powerful goddess. Powerful enough to take her own revenge, I'm sure. No need for us to get involved. Oh, definitely not. I, I, I'm going to get involved by stealing their armor, though. Let's have a look. Stuff! Ooh. Something I have many bonuses to. Chest. Like crossbow. Then we need a crossbow. Oh, Shadowheart, you need a crossbow. There, you can have that. Uh, 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 okay, there we go. Yeah, her arm, their her armor is gonna be way better because it's it's ringmail. Okay, yeah, yeah, ringmail is not the best as far as heavy armor goes, but thankfully, since she's a life domain cleric, she gets to wear heavy, which is why she is eighteen AC. Honestly, the AC of my entire party is great. I'm very lucky. Well, okay, I'm not lucky. I have specifically designed them to be that way, but I'm happy that I've been able to. Oh, am I over encumbered? Why am I over encumbered? Are these really heavy? Only nine pounds a piece. What's weighing me down? Oh, I only have 90 encumbrance. That explains it. Take all of this stuff. Lysel can carry it all. Okay, not gonna read any of this stuff. Oh, we just got an update for the Spirit of the Amulet. Good. Nope. Okay. Don't really want to spend much time dealing with this shit, but unfortunately, I need to spend a tiny bit. Okay. Peek, peek. Peek, peek. Yek, peek. Yek, peek. There it is. <laughs> took, me, took me a second to find it. Okay, and now I need everyone who is not Lysel. To fuck off, kindly. Okay, triple jump. Cause there is. Oh no. Perception failed. Okay, I'm gonna save. Please don't blow me off a cliff. Please don't let me bl get blown off a cliff. Actually, I'm going to stand over here. Okay. Safe. Um, Shadow Heart. Send a Shadow Heart. Shadow Heart. Drop item. Lilith. Lockpick. Oops. Real Sparky Sparkswell. Okay, so this creates a lightning aura that eats your lightning charges if you have them, but I don't, so it doesn't matter. There is, however, chests down here. I like chests. Who wants chests? 
we could we could go and get them and we could get stuff i want stuff is what they want me to say <laughs> i know better yeah i bet you're angry Someone's pissed. Hi, Ron. I have angered a chest, and now the chest wants to eat me. The chest wants to eat me and other stories for kids. That's a friendly looking shadow. Can't have disadvantage. Oh, I'm too far away. Invalid target. Well, let me make it a valid target. Hello, little one. Cunning action, hide. Okay. Zombie. Oh, the zombie can't hide. That's why they saw they saw the zombie. Path is path is interrupted. Where's the path interrupted? Can I shoot it now. There we go. Need to acid damage. That's fine. It's fine. Okay, Lizel, I need you to involve yourself. Starring, can you go over there? Come on, lizard. No, don't pickpocket my, the, my player character, please. Okay. Okay, that's one mimic dead. Okay, you're gonna go over there. You can't do anything else. You can't do anything else. Wow, that's a very scary dash. Oh no, they might catch up with me. I'm in danger! And by in danger, I mean... They're in danger. It would seem that they're the ones that are in danger. <laughs> That's the wrong person I'm sending that to. Oops. Yeah, there, it is kind of cute and slow and wiggly. Oh, I need an action for that. I'd only have the extra. Okay. I'm gonna hide over there now. Uh, zombie, you are not going to be useful no matter what you do. I'm not sending you down there. Okay, Shadowheart, you are not even in this fight yet. Oh, right, I already know it's immune to acid. I already saw that earlier, and then I was like, let's throw acid at it again. Uh, okay, Scratch, I need you to move out of the way. You're not going to be useful no matter what you do, unfortunately. Okay... Why do you not have an action? What was what action did you use? Okay. Starring has an action. It's weird. I don't know what's going on. Whatever. A disadvantage. Why do I have disadvantage? It usually tells you why you have disadvantage. Annoying. Fine. <laughs> I po I poisoned the chest.
Oh, they can't be prone. Then what is that one doing if they can't be prone? They look like they're prone enough to things. Ooh. Ooh, I have an idea. I'm gonna hit this chest with a chest! <laughs> ha! <laughs> well, I hit- I hit- I hit the chest I threw for 82, but I only hit him for 5. <laughs> oh, well. Roar to you, too. Okay, one of these is too far away, and the other one is in a bad spot. And I think that's at least somewhat intentional. <laughs> God damn it. Um, Try that. That wasn't an explosive arrow, that was a blinding arrow. Oops. Okay, and there's, like, no way I can hit any of these things, I don't think. Uh... What's the ideal? It's a good thing I blinded the chest. <laughs> yeah. Well... Can at least do that. Ironically, I'm pretty sure that the mimics actually have really good vision because they have like eight eyes. Target is out of sight. Target is out of sight. Uh, they. I know they put it at this position specifically so that you can't just. Oh. So you can't just fuck around and do what I'm doing. Mark it out of sight. Uh... Yeah. Um... For some reason, I can hit it with a bow shot, so I'm gonna hit it with a bow shot. Okay, well, whatever. Um, braced for range damage. This is a, it's a kind of an annoying fight doing it this way, but like, I'm not taking damage. So I guess that's probably better than the other option. Oh, that mimic just straight up died. Okay. Um, I can't. Sh Is there any way I can actually hit this? I can shoot up to. Okay. Can I go like all the way over there? Would that work? Or do I have to go down there? I might need to not go down there, but like. Do something of the sort. Actually, wait, no. Let's use fairy fire. That should hit him. Yep. Okay, so now I have advantage. On, like, all of my everything, so that's good at least. Um, you have an idea. Actually, I don't know if I want to use the Void Bulb, seeing as I don't think I'm going to get another one anytime soon, if ever. Man, this really sucks! But then again, I'm pretty sure that it sucks because they're trying to prevent you from doing what I'm doing to cheese it. Oh, that'll work. Kinda. A little bit. Oh! Oh! Awesome! Oh, that's gonna be really easy to hit now. Good. Scratch, why are you here? Please go away. I love you, but please go away for now. I just, I need... 
I need to do this a different way. That's interrupted, path is interrupted, path is interrupted. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this sucks! <laughs> okay. Well, Alchemist Fire isn't particularly hard to get more of, so... My camera keeps freaking out every time I go to attack these things. Because it's like trying to attack from a really weird angle. Sure, why not? Yay! All the mimics are dead. Enough waiting. I crave blood. Okay, who actually has Featherfall? Okay. Well, I'm just going to send Lysel down for now, because I don't trust... Everyone else to necessarily not die to something. Ooh. Your armor class increases by one. In addition, you have Bardic Inspiration. If you have Bardic Inspiration, you give one more use of it. Gloves that give just AC one more AC is are good. Actually, probably going to equip that immediately. What does everyone have? Actually, everyone has something better. You don't have to try not to get hit. And X. What? No, no, I didn't. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Kit. Back on there. I need that. Um. Lysel rolled a critical fail on a perception check. That's not good. No one wants that. Okay, well, this is why I'm in turn-based mode, so that we have... We can do whatever we want. And history check failed. Toy chest. That chest dropped the chest. How chesterific. Um. Cool. I'll take the toy chest, though. Yay, I have a baby chest now. It doesn't do anything. Okay, Harper's Dash. That definitely is trapped. There's no way that's not trapped. There, there, that is in every way trapped. Okay, someone succeed on something. Thank you, Astarian. Okay, disarm. Oh, it's a DC 20. Ooh. Okay, well, that's not going to help if I roll a 1. <laughs> um, I'm going to re-roll once. Please don't let me blow up. Can I do both of them? No, I can't. 
Oh, I had a plus eight. One more. Okay, I'm just gonna blow up. That's fine. Ow. Can I lockpick it now? Wait, why can't I lockpick it? Oh, because I did something, probably. Darren, can you lockpick it? Wait, you can't lockpick it either. Oh, you don't have an action. Neither of you have actions. Why does no one have an action? Okay, you do need an action. Okay. I think the chest was at, the mini chest was actually a method of of create like opening this chest or showing this chest. I mean, <laughs> oh god. Okay, we're gonna be here a while. Oh, we are not. Scroll of Fain Death and Scroll of Evidence. Scroll of Evidence? To the Emerald Enclave, those those deemed worthy to see this record, greetings from those who harp. Know ye that the one known as Cethric Thorn, Paladin of Shar, is guilty of crimes against body and spirit, etc., etc. Okay. Yeah, this is like... This is genuinely, like, 200 years too late. <laughs> Catherick Thorm is dead. He was one of the ancient... The ancient Sharian Dark Justice Ears. Oh, everyone failed. Okay. Is there anything else down here? I don't think there is, but I'll look. Ooh. I mean, that's death. I wish I could jump over there. I don't know what any of that is. It's probably just window dressing. In any case, we can just teleport back. Yay! Okay. Stuff! I like stuff. Okay, let's head down this way. At least one of our people can talk to Beasts, right? Who can talk to animals? Can no one talk to animals? Darren can talk to the dead. No time to rest. Okay. I gonna talk to this man. It's the asshole over here. Hey, wait a second. Absolute must have took you in. He sells things. Bronze ring, air of acid, basic poison, and hair growth tonic. Okay. Random. Shouldn't have hesitated, Greyling. You'll be a fine sacrifice. Got you, spider spawn. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I angered all of the random spiders. I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> My gosh. I wonder if this is worth the cost. 
Okay, well, whatever. Wait, why don't I have an action? What is going on? I should have an action. Oh, I'm hitting N to sneak, and it's using hide instead of cunning action hide, because cunning action hide uses a bonus action. Oh, God. I, I'm just fucking up horribly, is, is the answer. That is what is happening. I am just screwing up. Yeah, using a ranged ability point blank is not going to go well for you. You have disadvantage when I'm when someone's close to you and you're using a ranged attack. It's kind of how that works. Well, those are only level one, so at least they're not going to be dangerous, I don't think. Oh no, Scratch! No! Mm. Mm. Throw a spider at a spider. I could do that, actually. Here's an idea. Bro. That was not effective. Uh, lacerate. I got crawling gnaw. That's good. That means that whatever, when that dies, if it dies with crawling gnaw on it, it will turn into a zombie. Yeah, we get a new zombie. Cool. They're dying for me, all of them. No, that is the hope. Sexy. They're spiders, they should be weak to fire. I'm not gonna try to save on a... On, I'm not gonna use my shield on something this week. Wait. Knocked out? Uh. Is there a reason why I knocked him out instead of killing him? Weird. Loot everything! Okay. It doesn't seem like there's anything, anyone nearby, so I can just start looting. The chest. Potion die. The same people who hid that chest earlier. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, I should actually go and, like, do something useful. Oh, wait. Short rest. I'll feel that one later. Much nicer. And I will sell shit. I have since learned recently that... That if you have a high charisma character, your charisma affects how much uh, uh, how much things sell for or buy for. So I'm starting to use my charisma characters for more shit because of that. Keep the Harper emblem. Cool. Got my stiff. Gilded chest? Where gilded chest? Gilded chest? Sometimes things just pop up in a weird way. Okay, that's the elder right there. I think that's the person I need to go talk to. I have something to ask. Seen her run with a barrel under her arm. Just a small one, but enough to blow the drow out. Someone should grab it. Slaves are never gonna manage with pickaxes. Can't go chasing maybes. The sergeants are ticket in. Oh, would you look at that, Kerr? Someone's having a listen. A shiver runs through you. Your mind is awash with ancient resentments. True soul, no less. What do you think, Kerr? Should we take Nia's debt off her? Trade? Every time I see someone who you can trade with, it's always so exciting. Ooh, journal? I'll buy a journal. Okay. Um, I want near out, and it sounds like you have a lead. I ain't parlaying with more twat souls, and you got the stench. If I didn't know better, I'd say a mind flayer shat a worm in your brain. <laughs> Should split your head open and poke around in there if you lot don't pay up. Go on, try it. I've been itching for. F oh God. Please. You don't need to ask twice. Oh God. Your blade ready, Kerr. Drop it, Brithvar. You chop this one, and Nia won't pay a damn copper. Fine. Spill what you want, true soul, before I choke on your stench. No, I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to fight him. I, like, I'm trying to get to near, and if I fight every fucking person in this fortress, I'm not going to do that. Unless I want to kill them all first. I don't have any... Uh... No, I, I... I need to assassinate near. that's the plan. The shiver returns. <laughs> this time it's colder. Sharper. What? Stench don't lie. You're one of them. Oh, wow. There's a lot of bone. <laughs> I still have my plus 11. Plus 12. Yeah, I can't fail this. Hmm. Revenge, eh? In that case, I got a proposal. Want to earn some gold? What gold? I thought you haven't been paid yet. It ain't my gold I'm offering. It's the true souls. Thrins after the absolute glory. That's why she's got those slaves digging for Nia. But we ain't need glory. Just coin. And Nia's got plenty. 
Sounds good. Help Thryn free near. Then you and my chums grind him up. Whatever the spoils, we'll drop you a fat cut. You in. I'm worth more than a cut, I want half. <laughs> half. You drugnin. Fine. Half it is, but first, we need to take care of something. You've seen that weird orb I floating about? Knife it, and don't get caught. The cult watches through it, and we can't risk more twat souls showing up. You still Fair. something about? <clears throat> get on it. Hmm. Have explosive powder? Good. Drop it near the rubble when it's time. Flaming arrow or some such will set it off. I didn't know I had explosive powder. Okay. On. You're hogging my hair. Okay. Well, that's cool. Ah, there it is. That's what we need to kill. Oh, it's weak to thunder damage, you say? Cool. We'll, I will do something about that. However, it is time for us to take a very short break. We are going for our three minute ad break, as is a tradition. I will be back in a few minutes. It's a good chance to stretch and get water and, I don't know, take a piss, you know. I don't know, whatever, do whatever you do. Whatever you do, used to do when you were a kid and it, the commercial breaks would happen during your show. <laughs> Back in three. And we're back. Okay. Now I have to go find that blasted eyeball that wandered off. And also kind of maybe explore this area a little bit. Who's around here? Mind the master full for, for my Another drow. Just what we needed. Alright, more racists. Saw you arriving. Almost put a hole in your boat. Don't make me wish I had. You probably will. Drug true soul getting himself trapped. Let him suffocate. If the absolute can't save him. Okay, you no, not that. You're definitely someone I can trade with. Friends in a right ball egg. That rubber ain't budging. No matter how hard she whips them gnomes. <laughs> Nera's gonna be pissed. What you want anyway? Here to yap. Or looking to buy. Dry land means fresh stock. Okay, what do we have? Oh, the Banshee on hit possibly inflict frightened. Great club, uh, Yornal's great sword. No, I have uh, Falara Louv. That's probably going to be good enough. I always get the health potions. Okay. What am I using? I'm using the above awareness for giving me initiative. Ooh. Frightening things does sound nice. Darn, what do you have? Oh, his, his isn't very useful anyway, so... I could... Yeah, I think I'll get the bow. Give that to me. And... I can do that. Use the hunting short bow. 
sell that later when I get the chance. And the camp. Okay. And the hair growth tonic. Don't want that. Don't eat it. Okay. What can I steal? Torches! I'll steal torches, why not? Why is there a quest marker beside me? Oh, because the strong eyes here. I like torches. Okay, what are you just doing? What now? Is that how you welcome a true soul? You're here to take responsibility. Tunnels collapsed. Trapped True Soul near. He's stuck in there with poisoned geezers. We don't get him out soon. It's both our heads. Oh no, poisonous old people! No, poison geysers. Uh, okay, I've got some explosive powder that should do a trick. So, set it near the rubble and ignite it. That'll blow the drow out. All right. I'm gonna take these torches first. Okay. Now, I don't really trust what's happening. I'm gonna send everyone, or everyone, I'm gonna send most everyone up here. We're going to attack from up there. Because this is going to turn into a bloodbath. I know it is. Okay, zombie. I want you to go... And I'll leave you there. Let you block the ladder. Darn, you can go over there. Okay. You hide. You hide. Okay, Burb. I'll put you here, I guess. Okay, you're going to stay down here. Um, Burb, you are not following instructions. Okay. Okay. Everyone's hiding now, except for Lizelle. Good. Okay. And I need explosives. I assume medium toughness, so I need to hit it for at least 22 damage. Okay, go to camp. No, not you. Where is it? There we are. My fire wine stash. I don't know if I need all 
all the barrels, but I'm going to use all the barrels. Oh, well, okay, I guess we're stacking. That's weird. Okay. Okay, dumbass. Can I, can I kick your asses out of the way before I do this, or... Okay, I'll ignite it then. That's what you want. For bloodlust. Okay, I am going to activate false life. Looks like bloodlust is on. Anything else I want to use before I do this? Oil of accuracy, sure. Okay, draw poison. Arcane Cultivation. Okay. Here's what we are going to do now. Can I just talk my way out of this? Eh, whatever. That's fine. Oh boy, this is not going to go well. I wish I had hit that harder. Three? That's it? Ugh. Okay, this is going to be a mess, but that's just life. You're not very good at throwing spears, are you? Okay, I need to, to kill that scrying eye. I should have just waited for the scrying eye to go elsewhere. I don't know why I did it this way. Are you kidding me? Okay, no, we're... No, this is stupid. This is really stupid. I'm not... I'm... This is stupid. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna do this right rather than being impatient. Okay, we need to go kill the stupid scrying eye first. They told us to do that, and I didn't do it. And to no surprise, that was a problem. Okay. So, let's start over again. This won't take too long, we just have to go find the little bastard. Wait, is it? Oh, no, that's near over there. Where's the eye? Yeah, the eye's down here. Okay, so we're just going to follow this little bastard till we're in a place where we can bash it. I'm going to save this again. 
on the off chance that it's about to run back, because if it's going to run back, I'm just going to smash it. Am I being watched by anyone? Besides the eye? I think it's just the eye. Okay, fine. Okay, no one noticed. Good. Okay, back to what we were doing. Gonna go up this way. Oh, there's a potion here. Cool. We can loot this place after we've killed everyone, so I'm not too too worried about that. Everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. What are you doing? Oh, they noticed that I stole the thing, but they don't know it's me. Okay. So, Lizelle, you can go that way. Okay, you go over there. Zombie. I want you to go down the ladder and sand the bottom. Which will block anyone from going up the ladder until you're killed. Or down the ladder, actually. Nice little facet of this game. Scratch. There, you can hide as well. Um, Actually, I'll put you over... I don't know, there. Let's try that. Okay, so everyone is sneaking, except for the zombie, which who can't, and Lizelle, who also can't because she's down here. Okay, go to camp. Okay. Bring four with me back. Okay, you can hide over there for now. And I, no, I'm going to put you there. No, go over there. Go over there and place it. It's too far away because you're not using your legs. That's why it's too far away. You just need to use your legs and you'll be fine. Okay, and I'm going to put one slightly farther back. You know, for the hell of it. And then Lizel is going to be over here. Okay, let's talk to Thorm and Thren and make sure she's on board with what's going on. So that she won't get mad at me immediately. Yeah, 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 just... I don't have time for drug men outsiders. Uh, you better make time for a true soul. A true yep, soul same thing. With uh, I've got some explosive powder. Cool. No, not you. Go on already. Not the powder. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Wait, no. Let's do this right. In case I fuck something up. 
Uh, actually, I'm going to take Elixir Bloodlust and Drought Poison. And Elixir. Okay. Boom. That didn't blow it up. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's immune to fire damage. What? Okay, that's annoying. That means we need to use force damage or bludgeoning. But I don't think I can bludgeon it for over 20 reliably. So, force damage it is. Let me go get my barrels back. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Back to camp. Okay. Okay, and we need specifically smoke powder. I don't think we're gonna need more than three for that. However, I am gonna grab some fire wine. For reasons. No, 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 no. I'm gonna pause the music for a second. That's battle music. We'll need battle music in a moment. Oh, now they recognize that it's an explosive. They just needed to see something that was more like what they expected. I'm going to keep hold of the barrels for now. You know what? Since this is probably going to go south really quickly, I'm going to put some... Fire wine over there. You know, for fun. As a treat. Both, I need you to come over here. Over there. Yep. Okay, and then Lysel is last. Save. This again. We'll get it this time. Okay. Alchemist fire. Boom! Yay! That is a lot of fire. Finally! Worthless slaves! Your incompetence has been my ruin! No, it does not. Eh, I don't care. Thrin, the Absolute gave you everything. And this fiasco is how you reward her? Me and mine worked flat out. I was cracking the whip day and night. Tell him, true soul. <laughs> ah, I can throw her under the bus because she's going to be hostile to me in a moment anyways. You were lazy. No, no, I did everything right. Near pities you, Thryn. 
your errors and did, did you just refer to yourself in the third person? That's really weird. Blade, Dwergar. You shall have your coin. You're damn right I'll have it. Me and that one, we got a deal. We beat your ass and dig the juice out from your carcass. You bargained with this wretch. How vexing. True soul, prove your faith. Strike him down. Hmm. Well, I'm getting paid to kill Nier, so I'm gonna kill Nier. Heretics. Let Nier be your end. Stop referring to yourself in the third person. It means you're an idiot. Okay. Better make my next move. Okay, so you're already in hiding. You are going to stab this guy in the ass. Starion, you are also going to stab this guy in the ass. And Shadowheart. Nope, Scratch actually can finish him off. Scratch, kill him. Yummy dinner for Scratch. Okay. And things are really getting nasty down there. Do I have a scroll of... Do I have a crown of madness? Or a Tasha's hideous laughter? I do have a Tasha's hideous laughter. Oh. Blazel's been... Been... Uh, fucking duped, that's why. That's why she's set to... Uh, angry. Okay! So... Uh, I need to be able to stealth to do my stealth shots, but a lot of shit's happened down there. Okay, so who who is alive and who isn't? So near is the biggest and most dangerous problem here. Oh no, Quoth. Quoth has turned on us. Okay. Become invisible. Oh, okay. That was weird. Out of sight, out of mind. Okay, she'll be ready next turn to attack. Starin will also be ready next turn to attack. Uh, Scratch, I... I don't really want you to get blown up. I'm just going to send you over there. Okay, Quoth. Oh, wait. Is he on my side? Can't tell. Okay. Can't control, coerced. What does that mean? Okay, so it's a it's an effect of being charmed. What? How did she cast Misty Step? Oh. Oh. Stop using my items! You fuckhole! Okay, we need to hit... We need to hit Nier so that he stops doing that. He is not allowed to just fucking... Use up all my items. The fucking prick. Can I seriously not reach him? Oh! 
Gaming Sphere 6, thank you for the follow, and welcome to our community. You are welcome to lurk, but if you would like to say hi, how are you doing today? Okay, I'm gonna put him behind Nier, so at least Nier can't move without getting taking an attack of opportunity. Okay. Who is it? Who is where? I need... Uh, I'm just gonna go down here. I need to do something to near. Okay, I'm gonna use Scorching Ray because it hits multiple times. Actually, should I waste... Or should I expend one on him? Nah. Okay, hopefully this will... Break his concentration? Is it not a concentration spell? It's not a concentration spell? Uh-oh. Ends upon taking any psych non-psychic damage. Oh, okay. Okay, that's unfortunate. Um... Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna have to wait for now. Someone please hit Lysel for me so I can use her so that she doesn't fucking use up all my items. She used one of my void bulbs. The fuck? Uh... Okay, so we got two neutrals to join. That's not bad. Okay, I need to... Okay, I can go down there because... I'm invisible, so it'll be... I'll be able to maintain my stealth damage. I'm concentrate. Oh, I'm concentrating on being invisible, okay. Ooh, I got a, I got the frighten off on him. Ooh, sexy. Yeah, I figured that wouldn't work. Okay, so if he's frightened, he has to run away. What? Not move. Oh, okay. Well, whatever. Okay, now he's charmed, so he can't attack me anymore. That's not too bad, at least. I should start getting some people to drop their weapons. Okay. Well. Um, hmm. What should I do? We're a lot. A lot of people are dead already. I don't really need to do too much. Who is still alive who we're against? Is it just these three? It is just those three. Okay. Cool. Make him hide again. Well, at least I'll move over there. Okay. Quoth, are you on my side? Oh. That's weird that Quoth is on my side, even though... Uh... The others aren't. Why are they such a friendly? It's, I'm so confused. Uh, wait. My Rind Vision only blinds... How long did the blind last? One turn. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna go hit Lysel. Yay! Coercion's gone. Cool. Okay, now I'm angry.
Actually, can I move, like, way over there? Now I am angry. Fuck you. Honestly, I'm probably just going to kill all the neutrals once we're done. <laughs> Okay. What is he holding? Uh, I don't know if he's going to drop his weapon when we kill him, so I'm going to make him drop his weapon now. Yes. Yes. Let's give Lysel blessing, healing, blade board, and temporary health because I've set up Shadow Heart in a way that I'm very happy with. What's the Shield of Screams, anyways? Armor class increased by 3. Attackers take 2 to 12 psychic damage when they hit them with a melee attack. Okay, that's fine. Well, I'm not going to hit them with a melee attack. Um, I'm in full view right now. There's some way I could be in, like, less full view. I was, like, right there. It pr this probably isn't going to work. No, because he has dark vision. Okay, well, I tried. That was 20. 22. It's good. His weapon's dropped, so I don't know what he's going to do. Uh oh. I'm gonna attack something. Wait, did he pick up his weapon? Wait. Near picked up stores of screams. You, they, hold on. He. Okay, I thought NPCs couldn't pick up their own weapons. Like, once they dropped them. What? Okay. Yeah, also, I don't think he drops the whatever the sword of screams is, so I'm gonna definitely try to. Oh god, I didn't even notice that Lysel got pushed into the lava! Oh no! Damn it! Fine. Starin, I need you to dash over here. Okay, I'm gonna put her. Uh, here. Yay, revival! Uh, oh, I could he I could heal my- no, I don't need to heal myself. Um, eh, whatever, I'll offhand him if I can. Nope, I can't. Never mind. Never mind. You can stay up there. I don't really want to... I don't like using Scratch for things, because I know he's going to die, and that makes me sad. Yeah, I'm just going to... Mm, I don't want to move closer. Uh, What's the best bet? I'll use a greater healing potion. I think most importantly, I need to get away from the lava. Okay, all that's left is near now. I'm gonna try again to weapon drop him so that I can get his sword, because I don't know what sword that... Like, he said, it said the Sword of Screams. I've never... I don't think I've been able to get that before, so I'm excited. Damn it.
Okay, well, whatever. He's not going to survive another round anyways, so... Unless I have a command scroll, but I doubt that. I'd be lucky to have... I'd be lucky to have a command scroll, seeing as how powerful the command is. Uh, I see banish. No. Okay. Goodbye, Nier. Shindelrin's shit house. You see it. Cock stench had a regular in his skull. All the more reason to clear out. Here's your cut. Extra two, like I promised. Five hundred gold. Nice. Grab your gear. Wipe your asses. Time I scrammed before more pricks from Moonrise Towers move in. Your brain going mushy, Shark. That's where those absolute freaks hold on. Goblins, drow, gnolls, even humans. Ain't no one they won't try to turn. The way I hear tell, some prick there calls the shots. The general near called him. And there ain't no way I'm sticking around long enough to meet him. Okay, leave. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna just... Wait, what? I'm not gonna call him a slaver because, I, I mean, I don't care. Or, my character doesn't care. The decaying corpse lies before you. Oh? Remove its head. Uh, can I leave? And have someone else remove its head? Here, you have high strength. Can you go remove its head? Well, I mean, there is no head left, but like, let's pretend there's a head. The decaying corpse lies before you. Okay, good. I'm glad that I didn't lose that or something. Uh-oh. No, I want its head! So that I can get my bonus. Thank you. The head breaks off cleanly from the drow's body. Ugh. Head of the snake. Okay. Oh, I have seen the sword of screens before. Okay, it's not even that cool. However, these are really nice. The disintegrating night walkers. Can't be in webbed, entangled, or ensnared, and you can't slip on grease or ice. It also gives you misty step. Object catches your eye. A lantern, it seems. Though no light flickers within. A thick layer of dust coats the bottom of the lantern. Oh, oh, unfortunately, I'm stupid. And I can investigate. Yeah, I'm really stupid. This is not going to go well. Nothing about the lantern strikes you as unusual. Yeah, no, I'm really stupid. This is not going to work. To all appearances, the dust seems quite ordinary. Yeah, no, uh, <laughs> that ain't that ain't working. Uh. Okay. Ooh. The wearer bears the absolute brand. Deal with one additional thunder damage with thunder spells and attacks. Get thunder weave. Cool. I will take a thunder weave ring. Does anyone have any open slots? I mean, I have the magic ring. <laughs> the fake magic ring. Hmm. That means I can't be in webbed. This means I can't be anything. So I'm going to put the Night Stalkers on me. Send those back to camp. Spider's Liar. Cool. Wait. Nier also had one. That's weird. Maybe it means something. Maybe it's special.
Hmm. Strange. Okay. Who do I want to put Thunderweave on? I'll put on a star end since his suck. Color spray is not very good. I wish I could say it was, but it really isn't. Okay. I can't loot some of these people, but I can loot some. I can loot some of them, but not all of them. Oh, Corsair Greymon. Ooh, what was that? Yorgo's Greatsword. Shining Staver of Skulls. Oh, because he was the merchant, so he had, like, all the cool stuff. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. The rest of this is all getting sold. Okay, is there anyone else I can actually loot without getting in trouble? This person. Okay. Am I waiting on... Yes. Scratch, come down here. Okay. Everyone healed up. We get another Lithid power! Yay! Uh, I don't know who it would be best to put on, though. I might get Force Tunnel on... Lazelle, I'm not sure. Hmm. I could also get Luck of the Far Realms on a star and then let him do real damage. Let's do that. Okay. Why is there... Oh. You're a merchant, right. I got for us. Ain't no one stopping Clan Flameshade. But I yeah, that's fine. I I want to trade with you though. Or not, I guess. Aw. <laughs> annoying. Uh, okay. Uh What reason do I have to not murder all these people? There's three of them here. The guard who was up here was on the near side. Uh, there are going to be some people wandering around. Somewhere. I don't know where they are, though. There's the merchant that's out there, but that's fine, as long as I don't upset him. What? What is that I see? Why... Oh, because there's one angry spider down there, right? <laughs> okay. Well. I have an idea. I'm going to see about pushing some of these people in lava. Rather than actually having to fight them. Why fight people when I can just easily murder them? Starion, I'll move you over here. And Lysel, I want you near Elder Brithvar. Okay, turn base mode. I will be heard. 
So here is my plan. Save. Because I want everything here. Screw 500 gold. I want all the gold. Okay. Push. Goodbye. Someone. Only the guards are allowed. Hey, Astarian. Hi. You just got Thunderweave. Which means... That... Can I move any more? Okay, no, that's fine. Goodbye! Aww. That didn't work. Look at the far rounds. Eh, not bad. Stab again. Okay, and then I will go Zeph. And I can hide. Do I? Okay, and I will hit the Elder. Unless I want to just punch him, punch him back into. Actually, I'll have the chance to punch him back into the lava before <laughs> before he even gets a turn. So that's fine. Not enough movement. Seriously. Okay, fine. I will shoot him point blank then. Maybe he can't have disadvantage. Why do I have disadvantage? What is going on? Let's see where you are hiding. No more movement. That's that's okay. Yeah, go bite him. Do any of these people have cool weapons that I definitely want to get? Um, his weapon looks cool. Oh, affect an additional target per level. That's cool. Sure, let's do both. Oh. Well, eh, it's not bad. Fine. Ah, oh, it's just a basic great club. Oh well. Oh wait, no, no, don't, no, get away, <laughs> no, get away. I don't care if I take a, a hit. Get a. Oh, she's even closer to lava now. That's concerning. <sighs> okay, no, let's go and do that. Oh, gosh. Well, he frightened me, but I charmed him, so that works. Okay. Can I... Oh, I don't have another bonus action. Can I push him backwards? Or can I push through him? That did not work. Okay, let's just do that. That's not ideal. Oh, he was still melting. Oops. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. So, this is what I would call not ideal. Okay, he's dead. Cunning action hide. Oh. Gosh darn it. <laughs> okay, fine. Cunning action dash to get out of the way. Cunning action hide. Now I go here, 
And now I stab. Okay. There's not really a huge amount for Shadowheart to do right now because she's mainly support. Sacred Flame. Yay. Oh. Hello, Master Knight Zombie. You... You got 70 meter movement on a gnome? They have 7.5 meters base movement, do they not? How did you get them to 10? Oh wait, there's unarmored movement from Monk. Plus, I know his movement speed ring at least. Man, that's ridiculous. You mean like... Does that mean if you dash, you have... 115 meters movement? Or do you, is that once dashing? Because that's crazy. Also, welcome. Still, that's ridiculous. I thought I thought my barbarian was doing pretty good with like eighteen meters. <laughs> that is uh, that is really awesome. You must like theory crafting too. Well, you probably will like some of the content I make though, cause then, cause I've been doing some Baldur's Gate three challenges. I just did one where I was killing Commander Zalk, the level eight in the tutorial area, with only two level one characters. Aw, thank you for following. Welcome to the community. Oh, and but like within a time limit, not not. I like I didn't just spend forever collecting barrels and surround him. I did actually I was actually within a time limit. <laughs> that was a fun challenge. I intend to do a whole lot more too. Okay, I'm invisible. Uh, I'm invisible. Uh Oh, I guess being invisible supersedes the need to be hidden. Interesting. Miss this. Okay, I can do cunning action hide and stab and stab and back up. And burn. And stab with beak. This man is in a bad spot. Oh! The Vietar's love activated. It's cool. Let's kill this bastard finally. Yay! Oh my gosh, my two health. <laughs> I need a long rest very badly. Uh, okay, yeah, no, let's do that, and then... Let's go long rest right now. Uh, this game is the only game I've done a, ch a chal- This game is the only game I've done a challenge. My favorite two challenges was from Skyrim and Fable series, yeah. I've seen some of the Skyrim challenges that, like, you can do, and they all seem pretty cool. I I also watched Doug Doug, the AI slash coding slash speedrunner who does, like, a bunch of Skyrim and GTA and stuff, so, like, I've seen a bunch of his challenges. Uh, uh, does Zero upgrade playthrough for all three Fables and Skyrim? I did Fishing Pole and No Armor on Legendary. <laughs> That's fun. 
That sounds like it would have taken a long time. Okay, I'm gonna take a long rest so that my people actually are not just like dying. You carry a Githyanki relic. I will have an explanation. Oh god. Walk away now. I won't warn you again. Are you two seriously gonna fight about this? Uh oh, that's not good. I uh I I had a different uh a different experience with Gale with this character. <laughs> I uh my character got a bit uh horny and chopped off his hand and he got stuck in the stone and died. Because she's a dark urge character. <laughs> I didn't mean for that to happen. I just wanted her to fantasize about chopping his arm off. I didn't want her to actually chop his arm off. Oh, boy. So that's going to be fun. I'm sure that that certainly won't come back to bite me in the ass at any point. Okay... So, Relic, what's this artifact? What's this going on? Why are you two arguing? I said all the differences and go to sleep. <laughs> Just walk away. Uh, Relic, this is both that artifact, isn't it? Artifact is an heirloom of my people. Likely she spilled Githyanki blood in order to steal it. This cannot stand. Heirloom? Plunder from some conquered realm, more like. This artifact is the only thing keeping us from becoming slaves to our parasites. Be glad I have it. Don't make me kill you, Lysel. I will. Why do I feel like Lysel's gonna just, like, knife us in the middle of the night or something? Just, I just have this strange feeling. Okay. Uh. What would like? What would Lilith actually do? I mean, she likes to be. I mean, she she probably doesn't really care, except for the fact that it's protecting her life. Um, beyond that point, she doesn't really care about the feelings of these two, so she's probably just like, oh, fuck, just, just shut up. But she's also a charismatic person, so, uh, if Lysel's plan is to, like, go turn it over to her overlords, then that's not gonna fly. Uh, so, any idea how we can settle this? The bad blood must be purged. Oh my it's god. If you fuckers kill each other or kill one of you, I am going to be so mad. God damn it, Lizelle. You make every situation worse. Every chance to look the other way. But here we are. You chose this. God damn it, Shadowheart. If anyone asks. I'll say you were transforming. Don't expect to be mourned. Who's gonna ask? It's just me and Astarian. Okay, okay. Ugh, I don't... Okay, I don't want any of... I don't want either of these dumbasses to die. Is the problem. I need someone, because the only ones I have left are Shadowheart, Lysel, and Astarian. If I, if I don't continue... God, I know Lysel's gonna fucking stab Shadowheart after this if Shadowheart doesn't kill her now. Ugh! This is stupid. Who do I want more? Um... I want Shadowheart more. Should I try to persuade them? 
If I attack Shadow Heart, Shadow Heart's gonna die. If I try to persuade Shadow Heart, Lysel will stab her and Shadow Heart will die. If I do nothing, Lysel will die. I'm gonna do nothing. Unless I can per actually persuade the both of them, but there's I don't think I have a chance of persuading Lysel. So I'm just gonna say no. No, I'm fine. Lysel disapproves. Yeah, no shit. God damn it. Can I have the tadpole? Give me my num nums. No! No! I could have been stronger! A gift, blessed night singer. Usher her into your darkness. I'm annoyed. Uh, oh, I am so annoyed. Okay. So. <laughs> Withers. <laughs> Can I talk to you, Withers? Thy will. Dost thou require a new ally? Let's talk about hirelings. Well. Choose. Okay, I need a replacement for Lysel. I don't necessarily like Lysel. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to ignore you, Night Zombie, but uh, that was an intense, bit of an intense scene. Uh, why do paladins prefer chainmail because it's holy armor? <laughs> oh, you. A dark urge monk does sound fun. Also, I have not finished Act 2 yet. Or Act 3. So, uh, try not to give me any spoilers yet. I just, I keep creating characters and playing lots with them, and I like to be really thorough, so... <laughs> I haven't gotten that far, despite having like 150 hours in the game. Okay, there are... I could just bring in a norm, a random fighter. I could actually bring in a monk. I've never actually used a monk before. I would ideally like to have a character who can just who can use the weapons that Lysel just dropped, though. I could actually go Paladin. Where is it? Because Kurz is a Paladin. Hmm. I'm just going to bring another fighter in for now. No one stopped me yet. Okay. Go loot the dumbass. Me. One of them. Okay. God fucking... God fucking shadow heart. <laughs> Had to fucking murder people. <laughs> Heavy metal band. Okay, that is pretty good. Oh, wow. That actually looks really good on her. He's for the boots. Okay, I'm just gonna send the... Oh, actually, I don't need to keep any of that. Okay, all of that. Yeah, okay. Send those to camp, I guess. I don't actually drop those. Huh? Oh! Thank you. That is that is actually a really good plan. I should really... 
Okay, yeah, eye reading is good. Thank you. <laughs> My voice is actually feeling a bit rough, so that is a worthy thing to be doing right now. Okay, well, that didn't in any way go the way I hoped it would, but I don't need Lysel, per se. Ah, my quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Oh, right. He has, like, no money left. Okay. Try to get some stuff off of this character so she has more space to do things. There we go. That's a little bit better. Okay. So, we now have... Varana Sunblossom <laughs> as our fighter. You know, our new friend. Okay, I'm gonna actually sleep now, seeing as the Shadow Heart couldn't. God fucking. I'm so annoyed with Shadow Heart right now. Uh, this fucking box. <laughs> Actually, does she have... Where did she go when she's not... ...doing things? If not over, then through. She goes down with Withers? Oh, she goes and stands with Withers because she's a hireling. This vessel... Is at thy disposal. Do what thou wilt. Okay. Well, that's weird. This is the first time I've actually, like, seriously used the Hyreling, so we'll see what happens. Okay, yep, 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 fighter. Yep, you're a fighter, I get it. Champion for now. I can always respect her later. Ability score improvement strength. Extra attack. Warlock sorcerer that used Eldritch Blast only. That does sound fun. Oh yeah, I guess with uh, a lot of the sorcerer bonuses, that would be kind of cool. Okay. A surprise party, yeah. I mean, more like a never surprised party, being that they can't be surprised. Past level six. <laughs> I do get what you mean. Okay, now let's actually go back to, to what we were doing. God, uh, I'm still so... Uh, I'm going to be annoyed about this for a little while. So fucking stupid. So stupid. Hmm, lots of stuff. We'll see if any guards come because I'm stealing. If they do, I will just kill them. Uh, 
I mean, I don't mind killing more guards at this point. They have absolutely no problem doing so. The only one in this place that I actually care to maintain and not have die is the whatever the fuck his name the the other merchant yeah the broken canes are probably not worth anything but I'll pick them up anyways oh my gosh I have so much stuff on me uh yeah those aren't worth anything Okay. Let's sell all of this. Send to Varana. Actually, Varana, you should go and pick up the barrels before they, I don't know, before something bad happens. Ooh. Food. Not that I never that I ever have too like too little food. God, I uh, I'm so annoyed that Shadowheart killed Lizel. It's just so fucking inconvenient. What's around here? We can basically steal everything now. There's not really reason to not do so. Torch. Traveler's chest. Anything up here? Oh. Drawer is up here. A scroll of web. Cool, cool. There's a gilded chest somewhere, too. I just don't know where. Sorry, I'll stop spinning the camera so much. <laughs> if I can. Oh, is the merchant gone, too? Oh, God damn it! Okay, like I need to stop killing people because I keep running out of merchants. It's getting bad. At least I can still trade at the Mykonids. I need to not upset any of the Mykonids for any reason. That is what I have learned. I want to have a word. Ah, a visitor. You're a welcome sight. Okay, oh good, he has lots of money. Hmm. He wants to sell. Uh, I think, oh wait, I should check and see if I have any alcohol that's worth anything. Sometimes, yeah, that wine's worth 22 gold on its own. It's good to often look at that. Some, some alcohol can be worth a lot more than that, too. She cause like, I have so much, so many camp supplies. I really don't need more. Okay. Oh, is, does he still have useful stuff? I don't think so. Ooh, elixir heroism. I want that. Little giant's fingers. Cool. Okay. Let's go and talk to... Uh, 
Let's go and talk to Spa. And hopefully not kill any more of our party members. Right in your head. I don't think I've ever seen this cutscene before. They're all very happy. I really hope pink doesn't mean horny, though. Ooh. Voice of the Circle. What? What is that? Oh my gosh. Hold on a second. Everyone, can you... Just inventory sort. Voice of the Circle, okay. Uh, let's put that on Lith. Okay, what is this? Grant an ally of plus two on persuasion checks. Are you kidding me? I feel like that's going to give me, like, a, a plus 13, then. <laughs> I have so many. I have so, so many buffs to Persuasion and Deception now for this character. It is getting ridiculous. Yeah, I need to put that on someone else. Because it says give it to an ally, so I assume you can't give it to yourself. Okay. Nope. There you go. Cool. Well, that's awesome. B Whoa. Blooming drow head? Oh. Nier's head has become a thingy. Can I... Can I take it with me? It's not red. One second, is that like. No. Is this. Okay, that was right before. Can I take it? Like, is that acceptable? Um. That's creepy. It is a quest item, though. I'm just gonna put it back, because that's kind of weird. I don't really want it. <laughs> Do we... Who casts spells here? We have Shadowheart who casts spells. And she has the MILF staff. Which is good. Trying to think if I want to give her uh, the, the frosty staff or not. In any case, that's, I don't need to worry about that right now. Okay, so we're actually pretty good on XP so far. I would love to hit level 6, that would be great. And in the process of doing that... Let's go back to the Selenite Outpost. I have an idea. So, the very first boss you fight in this game, like, first raid boss, is the, uh, the phantom spider person thing. And the very second boss that you can fight, 
I think, is the one I'm about to show you. Can you please shoot? Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna put everyone over here. Everyone is gonna hide. Oh, um, I would prefer if you don't go down there. Scratch. No, 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 no. Don't I don't care what you do, I just care that you don't move. Okay, can I leave you there? God damn it. Okay, hopefully he's not gonna cause any trouble. Okay, can I shoot this petrified drow down here? Oh, I was I was really hoping that wouldn't be a problem. We're going boss hunting. Friend? Friend or foe? That's not a clear enough answer. That's a clearer answer. We didn't go into combat with it? Okay, that's real weird. Does this count as adventuring? Uh okay, well, she's in combat now. That's okay. Actually, that I kind of prefer Oh, I was really hoping that wasn't going to happen. Uh Okay, this is awkward. I've never seen the Beholder come all the way up here before. <laughs> that's, uh... Huh. That's that's a thing. That is a thing that I did not expect to have happen. Uh, okay. Cunning action, hide. Sneak attack. Is it weak to anything? No. Sneak attack and acid. Or no, that's gonna negate the sneak attack. And look at the far realms. 33! Okay, uh, now I need someone to throw the... Uh, where is it? I'm sure I have one still. There's an unpetrification thing. Or wait, is he petrified or paralyzed? He's paralyzed. Shadowheart, can you fix that? Yes, you can. Cool. Okay, you're gonna go over there. Look at the far realms. 35. Okay. Uh could penalize it. Nah, I'm just gonna go attack it like normal. Lacerate. A normal attack. An action surge. A normal attack. A normal attack. And pommel strike. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm so close to killing it in one turn. <laughs> I 
Honestly, I don't even need to do anything. I'm gonna go down there. Get away from the everything else. Oh. No. Oh. oh. <laughs> Well, that's fun. I offer to parlay, and he brings a spectator. Squit. Quite ruined my ambush. Now, you mm -hmm. are. Oh. Why Shadowheart? <laughs> can I. Okay. Can you go down there and, like, go talk to him yourself instead? Have I been this way before? Or do I not have that option? Can I, like, get into this conversation instead? Oh, Sassoon, flesh carver grants you your enemy's blood. Okay. Well, that's not useful. I don't need any attention right now. I guess I'm just gonna make everyone hide for now until I figure out what's going on. Ooh, a spectator. Ah, oh, yes, the first very rare amulet you can find. I'm gonna hide there. Okay, well, I guess we're talking with Shadowheart. Uh, I'm Shadowheart. You're welcome to, for the rescue. Helpless babes are rescued. I allowed you to assist me. I Don't make me stab you. Third son of House Bartol, first rank evoker, and initiate of Graven Hollows. Oh. Oh no, no, my dear dark gods below, no! A memory shard, a container onto which brief mental impressions are projected and stored for years at a time. Uh, it's fading. It seems like you've been frozen like this for a while. Far, far longer than I realized. Then my enemies have already <coughs> found the forge. Which bastard stole my glory? Zagrim, Philro. Oh yeah, because we found that that uh, Brandon Necromancer who was who was uh, fac uh, attacking us with the hook horrors, who was like angry and insane. Consider it mercy or pest control. Philro was never fully right. We were friends once, three of us working together to find a lost wonder, until the others grew jealous, began to guard their secrets. Do you have anything interesting as possession? Uh... Well, if I was on a different character, I'd have a plus 11. But I don't. I decoded his notes. He'd written something about some guardian of the Adamantine Forge. Oh, it seems his rather unique mind made itself useful. Clever of you to see through his cipher. A little too clever. I'd rather not lose one rival, only to have another sprout in its place. So try to take this as a compliment. Yes? Oh. Can I hit him? Yes, I can. Well, that was easy. The rest of them are going to be a bit of an inter interesting situation, but did kill that one at least. With haste. Okay, hide. Dab. Okay. And Vinok Ver 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 Ver
Okay, I'll go... I don't know where I'm going. This way, I guess? Uh, oh, I need to move farther. I can't be near the torch dock. This way. Okay, I'll send him down there. Hide him. Vrarner. You can come down there. What is, what is your name? Varana. Okay. Why is he spinning? Oh! <laughs> he was like, wait a minute, I know there's someone here. So I'm gonna go walk right over here, just in his peripheral vision, and hide and shoot him. Or, okay, whatever, I'll stop him then. I don't know if, if I'll be within his range. Oh, I unhit him. Darn it. Yes, I am. Okay. Okay, so that's dealt with. Everyone come over here. So we don't have to worry about other things. Okay. Lots and lots of stuff. God damn it! I was gonna blow that up and then, or I was gonna break that and then I didn't. Cool. Got the stuff. Around killing all the petrified drow. So I can steal their shit. Right, that is an important thing to note. Also, hydrate. Okay. Job. I'm not letting the third torch dock get me. Or the fourth, for that matter. Is there any more randos with stuff? I'm down there. Kinda. They're not in a very good spot. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so much shit in my inventory. Last pendant, that's for lightning charges, right? Okay, yep, that's not useful to me. I gotta take all of this. No. I gotta take all of this stuff. Send it over to Verana, seeing as she has actual carry weight.
Okay. And now that we've gone and looted everything here, there is one more thing I want to do this stream. Let's go back to let's go back to our camp for a second. Now that we killed, uh, I don't know what his name was, Dor 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 Knocker or whatever his name was, uh, we got the icy helve. We have the icy metal and the icy crystal we got from Philro. And now, put all those together, we get Morning Frost! When dealing cold damage, deal additional damage. When dealing cold damage, possibly inflict, inflict chilled. Chilled makes the entity affected entity vulnerable to cold damage resistant to fire. So that means it takes double cold damage and half fire. That I can send over Shadowheart. Now she is a cool stick. Coolest of sticks. Okay. Oh. So. We got Nier's head. And discovered Grimforge. There's a lot more to do in Grimforge. But for now. We're going to leave it at that. We also... Oh my gosh, I already forgot the name. We finally got Morning Frost. We killed the Beholder, which was good XP. Yeah, it was like 400 XP. Got lots of good money. Got a good, got some good progression in our quest line. And now, we can just finish checking out Grimforge, and after that, we get to go to Act 2. Though we can always come back to Grimforge if you want. That's not a problem. Okay, so. We're going to have to call the stream here. We've been going for about three hours. Our next stream will be on Thursday at 2.30pm PST. 5.30pm EST. Next week, on Tuesday, since I stream Tuesday, Thursday, I will be moving the stream time forward. It will be 1pm PST and 4pm EST. So that is, well, an hour and a half earlier than before. Just because Baldur's Gate, apparently, the viewership is earlier in the day than Path of Exile was. So if I'm going to stream as much of this as I am, then I might as well make sure to wait. Or, or to do it earlier, rather than waiting till later. This will go up tomorrow on App Black Cat Streams, and eventually it will go up on App Black Cat Studio as well as a highlight. I cut the episodes down by about two thirds, so if you want to catch up quickly without having to watch all the VODs, you can follow that. I release episodes on Tuesday and Thursday of Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, tomorrow's episode might be delayed till Friday, we'll see. And I think that's everything. Thank you all so much for watching. For everyone who's here, and everyone who's been here, I appreciate you very much. For those on YouTube, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.